We come across young people that are potentially at risk of offending on a daily basis. At those early stages, there is a potential that that young person could get into trouble. The impact of um, bad choices on a young person. Worst case scenario, they go down the um, criminal route and end up getting themselves, as they get older, facing prison. Worst case scenario, or getting a criminal record, which obviously will impact on their future where getting a job's concerned. Some of the barriers that, that young people might face, um, I think some of them are financial in relation to parents aren't able to, to give them the opportunity to join clubs. Social problems where they can't um, uh, get to the gym, uh, financial problems where they can't afford the equipment, the kit, the, the cost of actual training. Step Out Step In is a sports referral based membership where we get young people uh, to come and try the sports, train with us in uh, boxing and kickboxing. They are possibly young offenders or on a pathway to being a young offender. And our aim is to put them on the right path and get them interested in the sport rather than doing things they shouldn't do. Step out, step in refers to the young person stepping out of their old ways, their bad ways, and stepping into a new environment. We don't distinguish between anybody if they come from poor background or rich background. Everybody is an equal in our gym. And the funding for Step Out, Step In comes from a partnership between Active Surrey and the Surrey Police and Crime Commissioner. It's important that we give them an activity that they want to do because that's the best way of getting the best out of them. So as a coach, we listen and we try to develop them in the way that they want to be developed. Sport and physical activities that we've engaged young people locally with. We've done boxing, there's two boxing clubs local. Uh, we've done skiing, we've done rugby, we've done cricket. So the young people on the Step Out Step In programme, when they come to us, I've noticed they've become more sociable, more focused, healthier. Once they get deeply involved, that's, that's the really good thing about it. It's a lifestyle change and they don't want to go back to the old lifestyle. They stay with the new one because they enjoy it. It can be something that diverts them from being in trouble and it can also help them with their self-esteem and their mental health. I think if they weren't part of the programme then they, their life would probably be carrying on the way it was before and in most cases it, it wasn't going in the right direction. If I wasn't in Step Out, Step In, I'd probably be at home just wondering like what I would do and just feel very, like really lonely. They really support you and they make you feel like you're safe and I recommend it so much. If you ever need somebody, they're always there for you. Getting young people involved in sport, it doesn't matter what sport, as long as it's a sport that they're interested in, that's the main priority. Find a sport they're interested in. We should listen to what they want to do. If they do something that they're good at and that they really enjoy, then they're probably going to stick at it a hell of a lot more. Not every child or young person is the same. They've all got different ambitions, different goals. I think sport can be life altering. And I think if someone's particularly, if they've got a talent, then they can really turn it into a positive. And when you have someone that's on the ground and, and really down and self-esteem's really, really low, sport is such a great opportunity and we're all good at something. And I think that's the thing that we have to remember and it's finding that thing that we can really, really do well at. <laughs>